Living here in Macclesfield, we're incredibly fortunate to be close to some truly wonderful countryside. Just see here in Macclesfield Forest, some of the best countryside in Cheshire. So what we have to do is to make sure we keep the focus on, on protecting this countryside and making sure that we sustain the rural communities that are within it as well. And one of the key things we have to focus on, and one of my priorities, is to work with the farming community. I've had a huge number of meetings with local farmers to understand their concerns, working with the NFU, working with the Country Landowners, Landowners Association, and finding out what we need to do to best help our farmers. Because for too long, and particularly with this Labour government, they've been neglected. That's a pattern that's really started with foot and mouth disease, and then was sustained uh, with the focus being on urban communities, and then the real problems that we had with the rural payments agencies. So what we need to do now, and we have got a positive agenda for rural communities, and particularly for farmers, with the Conservative uh, draft manifesto that's being pulled together, is making sure that we tackle the, the, the really burdensome challenge of deregulation for farming. They're just swamped with too much paperwork. We need to make sure we've got a sustainable future with the common agricultural policy, and then work to ensure that farmers are able to produce great quality food. And that will help us as a country to have really sustainable food security. And we also have to make sure that government buys food from British producers and also ensure that, that British customers are able to see where the food is really produced from and make sure that we educate customers, educate ourselves to buy British wherever we can. And in doing that, that great work, we'll be able to support our farmers, help our countryside and have a more uh, vibrant future for our rural communities.